What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I am back from the unknown, and today on the channel we have the Star Wars Vintage Collection Lando Calrissian, the Empire Strikes Back version. Now, just a little while ago, they released the Return of the Jedi version of Lando Calrissian, which is great, but the downside is he doesn't fit into my Empire Strikes Back carbon freezing chamber playset, which I've been kind of working to build up. So I'm very happy to have this figure in my collection because I haven't purchased or had this version of Lando Calrissian since the Power of the Force version in the 90s. So he had this massive thick cape and it was fine for the time. He looked very, you know, jacked, but it wasn't movie accurate. So this is a little bit more movie accurate and I'm very excited to kind of open him up and see how he looks. So let's take a look at him. He has uh, the classic Lando Calrissian uh, that looks awesome in the front. Flip him over the back and you can see some of the other figures that were recently released and that were released along with this line. However, you don't see Lobot, which we will be opening up and adding to that playset soon as well. But without any further ado, let's go ahead, open him up and see how he looks. Oh my gosh, guys, I didn't think I'd like this figure as much as I do. This is Lando Calrissian to a T. Uh, the figure itself, great articulation. The blaster that he comes with, the Rebel Blaster, it's spot on. It's fantastic. His joints, his um, movement, I had no issues. I didn't have to heat him up or do anything. He's ready to pose. I'm not using him for any dynamic positions. He's just going to be standing there in my diorama. And even his soft goods cape. It's phenomenal. I love the pattern that they have on it. It looks great. He's going to look great in that diorama. I'm so excited to put him in there. The only issue that I have is uh, having him spin on the stand. He is kind of wobbling a little bit, and it took me a while to get him to stand with this spinning. And it's his high-heeled boots. They look great. However, I don't think they're 100% even or flat on the ground. I tried multiple times to get that. Standing is no issue, but kind of this movement is hard to get him to stand still. So if you do have him standing long term in a diorama, you may want to use a uh, standing assist like a stand or something under one foot just, just to kind of help him long term. But he looks great. I love this figure. And currently he is a peg warmer at my local Target. There are three of this figure still on the pegs and they've been on the pegs for a while. And same with the Black Series. There are three or four Black Series Return of the Jedi, Lando Calrissian's also peg warming. And those are the only Star Wars figures in stock at my local Target. So if you want, go out, pick up this figure. I love it. He's going to look great in my diorama. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. I'm Backroom the Unknown. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next one. Backroom out.